Hi party people, pardon the vlog angle. I am hanging out in my backyard, having a hard kombucha. Yes, it's 7% alcohol, but no one needs to know that. You just say kombucha. I wanted to give you a little heads up about what this next video is. In the coming months, I'm gonna have a lot of content go up on IGTV. Did a little thing with Instagram, and a lot of those videos are gonna be cooking videos. I Instagram how much I cook all the time, and people who follow me on Instagram, and if you don't fucking follow me, what the fuck? They're always asking for recipes, so I'm doing cooking vids there. However, I got a little slap happy, uh, eager, anxious, I'm not sure, and filmed a video before I realized that you're supposed to film a video like this. So I filmed a video of me making grilled artichokes, which couldn't be used on IGTV, and I thought, well, fuck it, let's put it up on the YouTubes. So this next video is that exact thing. Also, just so you know, I had just done a live stream with Grace and Hannah where I came as Michelle, Michelle Visage, I can't say it, from RuPaul's Drag Race. So that's why I have hooker eyelashes and my eyeliner is about to sweat off my face. You know, something new and different for me. We all know I can't do makeup. If you want that, then go click on James Charles. I'm sure he needs the views. He doesn't need the views. Please stay here. Enjoy. Today, I'm gonna teach you how to make one of my all-time favorite things to eat. I think it's sexy. I think it's complicated. I have a type. <laughs> we are going to be making and navigating the crazy world of artichokes. Now, I know artichokes can be very intimidating. I didn't know what they were for a very long time. My high school bestie, Ashley, actually told me when she went to Paris on a trip with her college boyfriend, someone was eating an artichoke and she asked if that was an animal. Which isn't that crazy of a question because look at this motherfucker. We described the inside of it as meat. You eat the heart of the artichoke. These guys look like, do you guys remember the knockoff gremlins from the 80s, Critters? And tell me that doesn't look look like an evil artichoke. But don't have any guilt, vegetarians, because these guys do not have a soul. Excuse me, pardon me, what did you just say about me, bitch? What the fuck? What is this no soul shit you're talking about? I wasn't saying anything to be offensive. You are a vegetable. Well, you look like a dollar store Wendy's logo, so. You are a bully, and I do not stoop to the level of bullies. No, a bully would pull those pigtails, but I ain't got arms, and you ain't got a pigtail to spare. <laughs> Seriously, I've seen more lustrous hair on a two-year-old. I'm not playing into this. In fact, I'm gonna kill him with kindness. You know what's cool? You got two different color eyes. You know who else had two different color eyes? David, David Bowie. Bowie. <laughs> okay, yeah, you've heard nice it. Nice try. He actually didn't have two different colored eyes. He had one people that was constantly dilated, which gave the illusion that he had two different colored eyes, and I am just so done with you. Okay, let's go ahead and start preparing the choke, shall we? There are a million ways to prepare an artichoke, all of them being kind of a pain in the ass. Here's how I do it. With a serrated knife, because it makes it a whole lot easier. Serrated is the kind of knife that it looks like it's got little teeth, you know, little chompers. I cut off, you know, the top half. If it has any prickly ends, you can go in there with scissors and take those off too. But as soon as you cut into this, take a lemon and you're gonna wanna go over any place you just cut because the artichoke will oxidize kind of like an apple will. You didn't know I was that smart, did you? I've been playing Scrabble. I'm saying shit like oxidize. Scrabble, huh? Here's a double word for you. Fuck off. You're also gonna wanna cut off the base, the little tail right here, so that'll be able to lay flat in a dish or pot. Once I've got a couple artichokes prepped, I stuff them in to a pot, put about two inches of water, a lid on top, cover it on high heat, and I let them steam anywhere from about 30 to 40 minutes depending. Once you can kind of pick off a leaf easily, tender, take them out of the water. Some people like to cut their artichokes in half and get the choke out before we start, but it feels counterintuitive because I like them to soften up so that you're not battling that choke. I didn't think I'd say choke this much in my life at one point. I mean, I did have one phase with chokes, but Choke jokes, that's all jokes. Then what I do is I cut the artichoke in half. With a spoon, I get out this little fluffy inside. That's the choke, that's what you do not want to eat. It would not feel good going down. It would be like deep throating a tumbleweed. You get out that little scooped area, get on out, make sure it's clean. You can run it underwater if you need to, what have you. Here's the exciting part. I covered these guys in olive oil tons of salt and pepper, then I throw them on a screaming hot grill to get a little bit of a char. Once that's all fine and well, I plate them up. I like to put a little sauce with it. Sometimes I do a romesco sauce. Sometimes you can do like a whipped butter cashew sauce or something. Today I'm going classic. It's just melted butter, salt, pepper, 
lemon juice, and then comes the eating part, which is just as scary as the prepare. You take one of the leaves, right? Now on the inside, that's the good meaty stuff. So you put it in your mouth, like so, then you grab, put your teeth on the bottom of it and you scrape the meat off. You do this with all the leaves. Some will be more tender, some will have more meat than the others. Get in there, Goldilocks, and see what you like. Mamrie, don't move, but you have two tarantulas on your face. Oh wait, those are your fake eyelashes. What in the Khloe Kardashian shit is? The very inside leaves should be not very fibrous. Oh my God, did I not tell you? Artichokes are a thistle. What? They say whistle while you work, but this thistle takes some work. I gotta stop with that or the bully's gonna come back. The very inside leaves should be so tender you can just eat those whole. And as a reward for all that hard work, you've got the heart of the artichoke left, that pure meat. You're just gonna eat that just however you want it, savor it, you know? Lick them things. Take a fork and knife to it, cut it like a steak. Do whatever you want. You earned it. It's a beautiful thing to eat this delectable treat. It's gorgeous. It's a work of art to choke.